Hey guys, Flux Flash Ore here. Today we're going to be looking at Lux support. My runes and masteries choices for her. She is so fun to play as a support character in the bottom lane with an AD carry. Although you can't do anything awesome like healing your AD carry. Although I do take the heal summoner spell so you get that one heal with it. You just, you can't do anything else, fuck. Other than be awesomely aggressive. So, starting off with my quintessences, I take three of the plus one gold per ten second quints because that is awesome. You, if you use the support talent, so in the utility tree that gives you two gold every ten seconds, you start off the game with a philosopher's stone. So later on in the game, when you go back to get a fucking philosopher's stone, you've actually got a philosopher's stone and a heart of gold as far as GP ten is concerned. Really awesome, lets you get more wards out onto the field, lets you get your items quicker, and you just become, oh my god, godly. So, I play with magic penetration marks, because that's very, very important as Lux. Also, when I'm playing Soraka, for example, I like that, because it allows my E to do more damage to the enemy champions, and also my Q, which is just legit. As Lux, it's even more important, because all of your spells are magic-based, and they're all offensive, so you're burning through people's magic resist, which is great. I play with the armor seals, because I really don't want to be taking damage in the bottom lane, and this just allows me to take a bit of extra damage, because, as we all know, armor reduces incoming damage. Oh my god. Why am I getting notifications? Fuck. Anyways, moving on. Glyphs. I pick up the ability power glyphs because having 9 ability power at the start of the game as a Lux support is just awesome. All of my supports unfortunately get this ability power bonus. I really need to buy some more rune pages, but that's beside the point. Moving on to masteries. For Lux supports, I play with 9 talents in the offensive tree and I play with 21 in utility. I go far enough into a fence that I can pick up the magic penetration by 10%, I also get 4% cooldown reduction because CDR on Lux is insane, and of course I pick up 4 ability power, which is awesome. Now, in the utility tree, I pick up the flash reduction, which I always run flash and I run heal when I'm playing Lux support. I want to be able to pick up this for the increased heal by 10%, unfortunately I would have to give up either reducing the cooldown of summoner spells by 15%, which is important if you're taking the heal one, because 15% on a, like, what, 6 minute spell is fucking insane. So, I unfortunately want to keep my magic penetration, so I can't get the increase by 10% heal, but that's okay, because if you're playing with Lux support, you shouldn't be overly aggressive anyways, you should let Lux do all the retarded stuff, and hopefully Lux knows how to get out. I pick up the reduces time spent by dead by 10% because there is nothing better to go through here. I I don't need the movement speed, I don't think, and the vision rate of vision range of wards is kind of meh worthy. I pick up the extra mana per level, very important so you can keep up the harass in early game. It gives you an extra 12 mana per level. It's nice. It really is. Then I pick up some mana regen. I only go 2 out of 3 into this because I need to move on to the next tier somewhere, so it's worth it. I pick up the two gold every 10 seconds, of course, like I was saying before in the runes area, because I have the quintessences and this. I end up with a Philosopher's Stone at the start of the game, minus the stats, of course. Now, increased experience gained by 5%. Why do I have this? Oh my god. Uh, don't mind me, guys. <clears throat> okay, this experience gain talent? Completely fucking useless. I'm going to be changing that to Wealth, because increased starting gold by 40 is awesome, allows you to pick up an extra pot or an extra ward, depending on what your items you buy are. And I'm going to move to, uh, let's see, I'm going to put another talent into the Meditation, so I'm gaining an extra mana regen per 5 seconds, really important, so you can keep that harass up. Of course, cooldown reduction is God on Lux, so I'm going to pick up the Intelligence talent here for 6% extra cooldown reduction giving me a total of 10% of the start of the game, which is awesome. And for the final one, I am going to take... Spell Vamp. Why the hell not? And of course, Mastermind to reduce the summoner spell cooldown by 15%. So, that is my Lux Support Masteries. I can't believe I was specced into the experience gain talent. That is so bad. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you learned something today. Peace.